The numbers are staggering. Every year, more than 800,000 people have a heart attack across the U.S. If you were one of those people, wouldn't you want to know ahead of time? As Team 12's Trisha Hendricks shows us, she has the latest on this genetic testing. After a bout with heat exhaustion over the summer and a visit to the cardiologist, Soilo Felix was asked to be a part of a groundbreaking Dignity Health study centered around combating heart disease. It's a great opportunity to learn a little bit more but also contribute to the uh, to the knowledge base uh, for health professionals. His wife Amy realizing this would be helpful to get in on. I had previously had an issue a couple years back but I was I was cleared but I still wanted to know what does my DNA say? The research study, the first of its kind in North America. To screen for people who are at high genetic risk for heart disease. Dignity Health Medical Director of Cardiovascular Genomics, Dr. Robert Roberts, says the risk for heart disease is about 50% acquired and 50% genetic. That means we can roll in early prevention. The study is comprised of 2,000 men and women between the ages of 40 and 60 who have no known history of heart disease. Using Amy and Soilo's DNA from a blood test and pre-existing genetic markers known to cause heart disease, the team at Dignity Health will be able to determine whether they are at risk of heart issues in the future. The whole process to sign up took about 10 minutes for both of us, and from there they sent it off to the lab. For those who want to know the results and end up having an elevated risk of heart disease, they can make an appointment to discuss preventative treatment options. Our results came back as intermediate risks. We're making little changes, just again, what we're eating, you know, not a lot of fried food and red meat. Helpful information for those who want to know. We want to be here for the long run. Trisha Hendricks, 12 News.